man. What are you doing over there? You weren't there before. What the fuck are those? Yippee! 2024. Oh, oh shit. Oh shit. We're going back. <gasps> 1990? If anyone asks, my name is Mara. Mara Forrest. Special Agent Forrest. That's me. Don't forget. Don't mess it up. All right. <laughs> Missing Persons Report. Atlanta Police Department. Uh, name Edward Crow. Ah. Is this Mr. Crow's country? Very nice. Is that a goatee or is that his chin? Reported by Natalie Crow, 27 female. Relation to missing daughter. Okay. Reported, reported to officer Detective Harrison James. <laughs> ah, that hurt me. <laughs> Ow. Uh, it's locked. There's a bronze keyhole. Okay, so I don't have a bronze key. No entry. It's locked. There's a silver key hole. Okay. So we got a silver key, a bronze key. Fine. I admit it. I dropped the bronze key into the fairy pond. It was an accident. It wouldn't be such a problem if we made a spare. All right. Ooh, a little Polaroid. Okay. That's uh, mildly upsetting and terrifying. Okay. We're going to pretend like we didn't see that. Oh, there's a... There's a dead guy. They attacked me. All I wanted was proof. What's your name? Arthur Mole. I just needed a better, clearer photo. All right, stay calm. You're bleeding quite bad. Uh, give him healing. There you go. Now you're all wrapped up. Come on, let's move you somewhere safe. You don't look too heavy. I'm a strong guy. Put him in our car. He'll be safe there for now. Tree Lady 3184. Interesting. Tree Lady. Let's let's do that right now. Tree Lady. Um <laughs> Yeah, it's gonna be hard to believe. Um, but I actually forgot what the what they were. My brain. So three, one, eight, four. Tree lady is kinda scary. All right, tree lady, what what do you got? I think I remember. You have talked to her? Uh, there was some kind of phrase you had to say. I don't remember what it was, though. Hark! <laughs> Hark, oh great fairy. Oh, Beatrice fairy. Purest pond. There is a fairy pond, they said. Guess that was wrong. Okay. Um, so yeah, there's gotta be something somewhere. Oh. Oh! Oh, that's a... Oh, there's more! Okay, okay, okay! Okay, I panicked a little bit. Uh, just, just a little bit. <laughs> Remember to get into the fairy pond area. Say this out loud to the fairy. Hear me, oh great fairy of the for or the of the fairest forest. Of fairest forest. It's pretty sensitive. It won't work if you have an accent. Sorry, Diego. Wow, a racist here. We're just gonna pretend like this guy. So hear me. Oh great fairy of fairest forest welcome child will you protect our precious natural world I will follow me God, everything is just so creepy 
I'm always so scared. So the guy who fixed the water filter did did it by running it through the air ventilation system. If you run the filter pump behind the curtain uh, with the incorrect pressure too high or too low, it'll trigger the ventilator. Be careful. Um, you can tighten up the pressure using the valve handle. Move the curtain. So, so we need to, f uh, that's a pool of water, examine. It's filthy. I can see that. Um, what is this? Those who speak the truth stare into the pure reflection of the fairy pond. Okay, why is the music so scary in here? Can you stop? Okay, so it is... Okay, so... Perfect! Perfect! I know games! You can't fuck with me! Oh, I see! You can't hide it from me. I see this little target here. Um, as soon as I stop moving around wildly... I'ma shoot it! Oh, scary. Hello there, lady of the- of- of the water. Give me your bronze key. Man, I'm good at games. Puzzles, no problem. Oh, Jesus, what the fuck is that? Oh, you're so scary. You- Oh, okay, you're starting to walk. Okay, hold on, hold on. I have an idea. Okay, hold on. Okay, okay, hold on, I'm panicking. Okay, hold on. Ooh, woo. <laughs> bronze keyhole, okay, so we do have the bronze key. All right, so this guy wants in here too, but we're gonna beat him there. <gasps> A haunted hilltop. I don't know exactly how far away. Excuse me. Oh! Sorry, dude. <laughs> Excuse me. What are you doing? I'm gonna get through this door. Oh, right. Is it locked? Obviously. Is there another way around? It's possible. Right. I'll go have a look. You're just not gonna like question who they are or what they're doing here exactly? <laughs> Animatronic bird, he's hooting and hollering. Seems like he hoots five times and then stops. Is he supposed to be an owl? It looks like a chicken to me, guy. So, five times. Ring the bell five times, it seems, huh? One, two, three, four, five. Hell yeah! I can solve puzzles. It's a phone ringing. Is that a ghost? Hello? You came back. Who is this? I'll admit, I'm glad to see you're up and about. Oh, the tenacity of you. Well, that's gross. Uh, my mom used to make me practice every day. Um. Wait, a green light went on? Because I, I, I played dead? <laughs> was that the actual puzzle? That was completely by accident, by the way. Um, things I could fit through if I wanted to. Yeah, let's climb through. Can I help you? Are, did, did you puke, lady? Are you all right, ma'am? My head. I threw up. Hey, it's all right, don't worry about it. Can I ask, did something happen to you? Uh, it only grazed me, I thought I'd be fine. I have something that might take, or make you feel better at least for a while. Here, have some antidote. You should take this. Thanks. I think that actually helped. 
Oh, I'm so rude. What's your name? I'm Mara. Thanks, Mara. I'm Natalie. Natalie Crow. The, the Natalie Crow? You're, you're famous. I'm actually looking for your father, for Edward Crow. What on earth do you want with my father? You filed a missing persons report, didn't you? Yes, I did. You're who they sent? Yeah, I'm Agent Mara Forrest. But you're so hot, right? <laughs> what? What about the man I spoke to on the phone? Detective Harrison something? Detective Harrison James. Uh, he couldn't make it. Problem with his car. So they sent you instead? Yep. <laughs> I'm gonna answer the phone real quick, okay? You, you wait there, you little freak. Oh my god! What is that? I had no idea the roots were for, or what the roots were for. How could I have known? What roots? What are you talking about? There are seven in total. And I cut them down. Cut them open. You cut them open? What? All but one. We left one intact for posterity, we thought. What a farce. Okay. Oh, this was the theater. Okay. So we're doing a little bit of backtracking here, which is very nice. Oh, the mouth is open now. Why was this open? It wasn't open before. I shouldn't have to say this, but for your safety and my sanity, please do not eat any of the mushrooms. Don't tell me what to do, man. What are you? Are you? Oh, you're, ew, you're like a mushroom king. There's a button on his head, press it. I invited um, Amanta Bisgoria to dinner. Alas, I find myself dining alone. I'm afraid the destroying angels will be thrown to the pigs. I have no idea what that is. Uh, by decree of his royal highness, the monarch of many mushrooms, I was gonna call him many shroom. Um, the court finds the following to be innocent and harmless. So blusher, moral, and shiitake. All right. By decree, what, what, what are dangerous? Death cap destroying angels, deadly dapperly. Okay. I'm afraid the shiitake will be thrown to the pigs. Okay, so this this one should be harmless. So I'm gonna eat this because it's a shiitake mushroom. Wait, this could be dangerous. Eat it. Delicious. Find myself dining alone. Deadly dapperling. Okay, so that one's dangerous. Okay, so more morcella. The moral misses Morcella. So I'm gonna eat the mushroom. Delicious. I am so glad I ate that. Fa Falodes. Death cap. Okay, not good. So Amita Rubicens. Rubicens. Okay. Rubicens. Eat the mushroom. So the others should be bad, right? What if I eat them and I and I take the antidote afterwards? Am I is that what I'm supposed to do? I don't think so, right? Did you steal that bike, sir? Police detective Harrison James. Hey, aren't you my boss? I was supposed to be here hours ago, but some kid broke into my car this morning. A little punk slashed my tires too. Oh. Oh, that was me, huh? Groovy. <laughs> that was me. Actually, Mara, maybe you can help. I was supposed to meet up with a woman, Miss Natalie Crow. You haven't seen her around, have you? I'm Natalie. Natalie Crow. The, the Natalie Crow? You're, you're famous. Do we tell the officer? No idea. Sorry. <laughs> nah, that's okay. Thought I'd ask just in case. Well, I didn't think he was going to show up. Do I need to go to the hospital? Mara? Just sit tight, all right? You'll be safe in the car. Yeah, don't be such a bitch. <laughs> are you done? Can we leave? No, sorry. Why? What are you doing? I have to find Edward Crow. The owner? Mara, the park shut down ages ago. He won't be here. He's here. I have to talk to him. Why? There's something I have to tell him. 
Yeah, I'm kind of curious as to why Mara needs to talk to Mr. Crow. Because apparently we're not with the police. Why are these like weird? Oh! Oh no. Is that a shotgun? Wait, 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 wait. Do they, all the names start with like different? So S, South. Oh, East. So, so this one's facing East for Estelle, right? And then this one will turn to the South, right? And then this one goes North. Perfect. And then this one goes West. There, we did it. Room. I won't budge. Maybe disable the trap somehow. How is this not it? One grave has two names. So, oh, Solomon Weasley. So Southwest. You're right. Holy shit. Oh, this one's South. Solina. Why did I turn this one? Norbert Easley. So Northeast. Woo. We did it. Take it. It's stuck. Keep pulling. Am I going to take the arm as well? I'm, I'm... <laughs> I guess it was just a plastic decoration. Oh, the gun broke? Hey, that's fucked up, man. I wanted it. Oh, Jesus fucking... Oh! Um, grenade. Grenade. Oh. I'm, sh I'm shooting you in the... I'm sorry. Oh, you dead, motherfucker. Oh, my heart. Pull this out. There you go. Nice. I wonder if I didn't have to kill that thing. I left the shotgun in the submarine. Shark, 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 dolphin. At least I think that's the quickest way I... have <laughs> I was ever good at math. What the fuck does that mean? I'm not no mathematician, but I, I don't think a uh, shark is a, a attributed to a, a, a numerical value. Ooh, there's naked ladies on the wall. Nice. Excuse me, hello? Tom B. Stone, the year of Solina died. Um, uh, I, I didn't check uh, it's some kind of clue. Didn't I see that name somewhere else just a minute ago? So 1805 and 1872. So when the year they, that they died. So 1872. 1872. 1873. 18... 70... Was it 73 or 72? Alright. I said 73. What the fuck is that? Oh, it's a crank. I love cranking it. Finally. Hey, how'd you get inside? I went through the crypt. <laughs> there was this tombstone puzzle with a shotgun and this ticking clock. Okay, I didn't ask for your life story. Oh, sorry. I'm just kidding. You did good. <laughs> All right. Now, there's work to be done. All right, fair enough, lady. What are you doing? Yeah, I think this is the best spot. Best spot for what? I assume he uses that elevator, so you'll see that for sure. Are you talking about Edward Crow? Yeah. Hey, would you help me out with something? Uh, sure, what do you need me to do? I need to clear off these tables and then lay out some documents. It won't, it won't take a minute. All right, all right. That'll do it, thanks for the help. Well, catch you later, stay out of trouble, all right? Fair enough, Julie, if that is your real name. For the attention of Edward Rowe. Damn, there's all this like evidence here. Okay, I'm gonna save it again and then we'll do this next time. <laughs>